Now I want to do uh, trim one more pot and trim it like I normally trim it, and uh, which is relatively rapidly. And the goal here is not to trim extremely rapidly, but to trim a good pot. But if you have lots of pots to trim, then it, it helps to be able to trim it at a reasonable rate. So I take the larger loop tool, remove the excess clay on the outside here. Cut. Start from the center, work toward the sides, establish the size of the foot there. Usually I put a, a swirl, kind of a decorative swirl in the middle. That's about it. Burnish it with my finger. Trim a little bit more undercut there. Bring that. Pull it off the wheel. Now usually I just take two lugs off. Might even put a mark there with my fingernail. Mark on that one. That way I can set it right back down if I feel like I pick it up and it's too heavy. Uh, it's, it's okay. Now I'm going to do a little bit of undulation. Dampen the rim like that. I mean the, the foot. And then sort of mimicking what's going on in the rim. <clears throat> there. Just down there. Pick it up so you can see it. Now see how the foot's lifted slightly so you get a little slight shadow under there? That's that's important. I mean these minute details, these small details, added all together is what gives a pot its interest. So look at it critically. Look at your, your pots and Anything that you have to say about my pots that might improve them, be feel, feel free to write it down. Give me some hints. Thanks a lot. Bye.